Welcome back everybody. I got you another video today. Before we get started, go ahead and hit that like and subscribe and that notification button to get all the updates and all the videos that I put out. Now this is a disclaimer. Disclaimer. Persons depicted in this video are presumed innocent until proven guilty in a court of law. This video is for educational and news purposes only. All information has been supplied by law enforcement agencies and is considered by law to be public domain information. Body-worn camera footage has been edited for length and in accordance with YouTube community guidelines while maintaining a journalistic focus. Now this happened on 4-12-2024 in Palm Beach County. And what it was, it was nighttime and the FWC were out on patrol and they noticed there was a boat that was speeding past a sign, you know, no wake zone, slow zone. But anyway, they were speeding, so they pulled him over. They asked the guy a couple questions and during the process he said he had had two to three high noons. And let's just go ahead and take a look at the video. Good. So the reason why I'm stopping you is uh, the sign. You blew right past the sign there, and you kind of stayed on plane for quite a while. Yeah. Do you have uh, your registration and your ID with you? Uh, it's my boat. Oh, okay. He's just a driver. All right. Well, we're just gonna talk to the, the driver then. Just I just need his ID though, because he's the one driving. Do you have Do you have your ID? Yes, sir. You don't. Where's it at? In my truck. Where's your truck at? Hey, your doc. Okay. Uh, can you get the registration from him and then all that stuff? I know where. Can I get it for him? I know where it is. Sure. What, what's wrong with him? Oh no, nothing whatsoever. I just. Do you not know where it is? Yeah. Can you get Can you get it from Can you get it from him, please? Yeah. What's that? He doesn't know where the registration is. He, he just told me it was right down there. Is, is it down there or not? I know it's there, but I don't know where. Okay, fine. Can you grab the registration, please? Yes, sir. Uh, you can stay on this side, that's fine. Alright, just registration, I don't know, there's a bunch of stuff in there. Which state is your ID out of? Florida. Florida. And what's your first name? Eighty nine. Do you have a boater ID card, a boater safety card? I'm sorry. A boater's license, a boater safety card? You don't have one? No. How, how old are you? What, what year were you born? 77. 77, okay. All right. Can you just pull out the three life jackets, type four throwable, fire tension, horn and whistle? Yes. Yeah, if you want, just, just walk with him and grab all the stuff for me, please. Walk with him? Yeah, go with him and, and help, grab all the stuff, please, yes. Type 4 throwable. It's under there. There's four here. Yeah, I just need the, the, type, the type 4 throwable. You don't have it? Oh, yes. It's yeah. You can close the hatch. A uh, fire signature and a sound recent device. You need to get a new fire signature. See, it's not in the red. It's empty. The charge has been expired. Sorry. Yeah. Sorry. Uh, what else? A sound producing device. Got a horn right there. Horn. Okay, perfect. And what else? 
that, that's it for right now. Okay. Yeah. Um, oh, here, uh, here's his uh, name we did first. All right, come on over here. So, do you do you know about the slow speed, idle speed? Do you know the difference, all that stuff? Okay, so why why were we going past the sign there? You missed it. Okay, got it. Um, um, where are you guys taking the boat back to right now? Oh, Nose Park. Okay. What's that? We live in Sherwood Park. Okay. Oh, how do you guys know each other? Oh, your wife's brother. Okay. Um, where did you guys where you go? Come on. Around. How long y'all been on the water tonight? Two, three hours. Just cruising around. Not too long. For how long? Not too long. Not too long? Okay. How much you had to drink tonight? Two or three drinks. Two or three drinks? Yes, sir. On a scale of one to ten, ten being thrown up drunk, one being not drunk at all, how drunk are you? Four. Four? Yes, sir. So you feel the effects of alcohol? Are you maybe three left? I don't believe so. But you're a four on the scale of one to ten, but you don't feel the effects of alcohol. I don't believe so. Oh. I'm just nervous right now. You're nervous. Yes, Should you be driving the boat right now? Before this, I felt that it was yes. Sir. You felt safe to drive the boat. Yes, sir. So you don't feel the effects of alcohol. I'm just nervous. You're nervous. You're nervous? Yes, sir. So how many? Have, how many? How much have you had to drink tonight? Two or three drinks. Two or three drinks. Yeah. When's the last time you uh, had something to eat? What'd you, what'd you drink? High noons. What? High noons. High noons? Yes, sir. And, and how, how many of those did you have? Two. Two? Uh, maybe three. Maybe three? Yes, okay. And then when did you start drinking today? Two or three hours ago. Like two I or just, three hours? I got out of work and then we went out. Okay. And so you've only, in the two or three hours that you've been out, you've only had two or three high noons? Yes, sir. Okay. Gotcha. All right. Um, what about you? Have you been drinking? Okay. Um, how about you? Are you safe to drive the boat? Yes, sir. Then, then why are you not driving? It was testing out the boat. Okay. All right. You want to step on our boat and do some field sobriety tests for us? You want to? Perfect. Yeah, so, like, yeah, that's so, not, that's not so yeah, so so here's how. No, no, absolutely. I'm gonna explain everything. So you can ask whatever questions you want. Um, you want me to, can I shut down? Or? If you if you like to, sure. Let's tie off on the back there. So, basically, at this point, I'm giving you the option option to. Give uh, this per perform the uh, field sobriety test. Okay. Because I suspect that you're operating while impaired. Okay. Okay. So failure to submit to the uh, the task would result in me to make a decision based on what I've seen thus far. So I'll have no other um, options to to make my decision based off of. Okay. Do you understand that? Yes, sir. So if you refuse those, then based off what I've seen thus far, I'm convinced that you are operating under the influence. Okay. So the, you performing the, uh, the task that I'm gonna ask of you is basically your chance to dispel my suspicion. Okay. Okay, so will you perform the, you wanna come on over and, and take a so seat and we'll go through the everything? If I say no on it, what does that mean? Like I've never been in this situation before. Yeah, so I'll, I'll explain it again. So if you say no, I'll have to make my decision based off what I've seen thus far. Okay. Right, so and then what I've seen thus far is you are not safe to operate this vessel. Okay. So I'll arrest you. So if you'd like to come over here and conduct the task, you could have your chance to dispel my suspicion. I just never been in this situation before, okay. so like I have no like I have no idea like Right. Well, unfortunately, you've been drinking and you're driving a boat. And then you're blowing through a slow speed zone. So.
So what do you think, sir? It's a yes or no answer. Is there a possibility that, like, somebody just drives and I'm... Um, that's, that's what should have happened from the get-go. Yeah, that's 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 the correct shop correct correct option from the uh, from the start. So I guess yeah, you could just step right over there, step right on over. Yeah, you give the watch away. If if you want to give the watch away, sure. Yeah, you need okay. help? No, or? no, no, no. Okay. I just didn't Yeah, know so we'll just walk right around. Wrong. And you just walk around to the front there? Mm hmm Go ahead. You can walk around. Okay. Sorry. Just never, like... Yeah. Um... You can just sit right here on the seat. Doesn't kill those lights off? Just hold, just hold that. Can you take your hat off for me? Do you have any uh, defects or disabilities? Are you are you injured or anything? My shoulder. Your shoulder's injured. Do you have uh, defects with your eyes? Like, do you have contacts on it or anything? I do not. Have contacts. Okay. Uh, are you under the care of a dentist? Have you had any teeth work or anything done recently today or past couple days? Not in the last couple no. days, no sir. Are you taking any medications or drugs? No sir. Just alcohol. That's it. No no drugs. No. Okay. All right. So the the what I'm gonna do is I'm just take a look at your eyes. Okay. Alright. Apparently this is a sixty hour a week, so Yeah. I okay. I don't know if that matters. No, no, it it, it does. Okay. Um sit at the edge of the seat just like you're doing. Uh, put your arms down at your sides. Just relax just like that. Uh pl place your feet like shoulder width apart so you're comfortable. You comfortable like that? Good. Uh and just stay in that position and don't do anything until uh, I ask you, okay? Understand? And you're not wearing any contacts, right? You said no? Correct. Okay. So I'm going to check your eyes. I want, I want you to just stare right here at the tip with my finger. All right. So I want you to just stare at that. And I want you to follow that with your eyes, your eyes only, and don't move your head. Do you understand? Yes, sir. Okay. A couple times, take about a minute and a half, okay? And this one I'm going to go up, I'm going to go vertical, okay? So just follow with your eyes only. Alright. Perfect, you can relax for a second. Go, go uh, talk to him 
to see if he's safe to drive too. If not. All right, so the, the next one I'm going to do, uh, I'll give everything to you. I'll give you the instructions, and I'll demonstrate it. And then if you have any questions, you, you let me know, okay? So you're going to place your hands palm to palm with one hand up and one hand down. It's going to be like this. Yep, perfect. And just keep it perfectly like that. Remain in this position while I explain the task. Do you understand? When I tell you to begin, turn the top hand over and count out loud one. Then turn the hand back over and count out loud two. Count it only when the hands make contact like this. So your hands are going to be here. And then you're going to go one, two, one, two, keeping your hands straight and parallel and even, okay? Repeat this, speed up as you go, and do not stop until told to do so. Make sure your hands and fingers stay parallel during each pat, like this. So, again, hands are here. Parallel. One, two, 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 and just and just keep on doing that. Yep, and speed up, and I will I'll tell you to stop. Okay. Okay. One, two. I didn't tell you to start yet. So sorry. Sorry. All right. All right. Never been in trouble. Do you do you understand everything? Do you have any questions before you start? I believe is keep the fingers and then one two one two one two one two and speed up as you go and then I'll tell you to stop okay begin one two 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 try to speed up a little bit one two one two one okay perfect you can stop thank you. And you can relax, you can put your hands on. We're done with that one for All right, so we have two more taps. Okay. The next one is going to be the finger to nose. And I'm going to do the same thing. I'll give you the directions. I'll explain everything. I'll demonstrate it and all that stuff. So we're just going to just go step by step here. So I want you to make a fist with both hands. Extend your fingers. Extend your index finger and turn your palms forward. So basically you're going to just make a fist with your hands down at your side. Yeah, just put them down at your side right there. Extend your index fingers forward. And just stay right there and stay like that until I tell you to begin, okay? When I say begin, you tilt your head back a little bit, about a 45 degree angle. You could close your eyes. And then when I tell you to, touch the tip of your nose with the tip of your index finger and immediately return it to your side like like this. So you're going to be sitting just like you are. Remember, stay stay in the position like I told you. Oh, sorry. So stay in the position like, you, like I told you. Beautiful. All right. Now what you're going to do is... When I say left, you'll take your left hand, bring it up after you tilt your head back and close your eyes, and touch the tip of your finger to the tip of your nose. Okay. Okay? Can you see that? Yes, see how sir. my, the, 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 it's yes, just sir. like this, tip to tip. Yeah. Not like this, right. not like this, not not over here. Right. The the very like dime size tip here and the dime yes, size tip sir. there. So tip to tip, just yes, like sir. that. You got it? Yes, sir. Okay. 
When I say right, you must touch the right. When I say left, you must touch your left, etc. And return your hand back down to your side. Sure. Do you have any questions about that? Or you want me to explain it again, or are you good? So, I keep it like this, correct? Yes, sir. And, and then, then when I, I go out, and then I so I'll say left, towards. I'll say left or right, and left then you bring right. that finger up, touch how I told you, tip to tip, okay, not the, and then bring it back down to your side, and I'm going to call out left or right, whichever one I call, okay. you touch, Very and good. then bring it back down to your side, yes, and sir. remember what you, do you remember what to do with your head, and close your eyes, yes, sir. okay, begin, left. Right. Left. Right. Right. Left. Okay, we're all done. Okay, and the last one, it's four steps. I'm gonna explain each each step, and I, I can repeat it if you if, if you need me to. Okay, so just just listen, and I'll, I'm gonna go through it, and then I'll, I can go back through it again. Okay. So you're gonna make a fist with fist with both your hands. Place your left fist at the center of your chest, and your right fist against your left fist, like this. So left fist on chest, right fist on left. So left on right, and just just like that. So that's that's gonna be the first step. So go ahead and put your left fist on your chest and your right fist on top of that and stay in that position until I tell, tell you to do so. Do you understand? Yes, sir. All right. When I say begin, you must perform four tasks. First task is to count out loud one to four while you move your fist out in a step-like fashion, making contact with your fist at each step. So it's going to look like this. So just as you are here, and I'll, I'll, I'll demonstrate for you. So. You got your left and your right, and you're just gonna go one, two, three, four. So that's your first step, okay? Going outwards in the same. Yeah, so just okay. just step out like, and then count to four. Okay. The second task is to memorize where your fists are. Once you have counted to four, and then what you're gonna do is, after you get to four, you're gonna clap your hands three times. One, two, three. Okay. And then you're gonna return to your position that you were just in, okay? So I'll, I'll, I'm going I'm to go through it all again. So we're here. So we're going to go one, two, three, four. And we're going to go one, two, three, and then right back to here. Okay. Okay? And then the, the third thing is that now you're here, and you're just going to bring your fist back in the same step-like fashion, counting out loud, five, six, seven, eight. So just like so. And then the fourth task is to open your hands, put your palms down on your lap. So I'll go through the whole thing one more time. All right? So you have your fist on your chest. You're going to go one, two, three, four. Okay. Remember the eyes of that? One, two, three. Boom. And then you go five, six, seven, eight to your chest. And then you're done. And palms down on your on your lap. So those are four. out, clap, back, down. Very good. All right. Do you have any questions? So it's a one, two, three, four, clap, clap, clap. Three. Boom, 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 boom. Back, hands up. You got it. Okay. So one, two, three, four. One, two, three. 
and then five, six, seven, eight. Is there a time frame with anything? No, nope, no time frame. Okay. Just, just complete all the tasks in, in the manner of which I described for them. Yes, sir. All right, you, are, you, you understand everything? We, At, said, we said left on. Yep, left. Okay. And then you're right. Yep. Okay. Whenever you feel comfortable, you can begin. So it's one, two, three, four, clap, clap, clap. Perfect. All right. Thank you so much. Yes, sir. Stay still there for a second. Just uh, stand up real fast. I'm gonna just put you in the cuffs real fast. Put your hands on your back. Baby, I love you. Uh, hey, uh, where's that life jacket? No, him. Hold on. Yeah, put that on him. And just sit down for a second. Maybe I love you. Sorry. I'm gonna flash the boots for a second. So yeah, that's fine. Uh, hey, Gilmore, come here real fast. So, is this like a gun club thing, or like where gun is club? The um, so what's the deal? So what did he tell you? Why why did he let him drive the boat? He was, uh, wanted to test the boat, I guess. He, he wanted to test the boat? Or you wanted to test the boat? I, I'm, I'm no, confused. I was testing the boat. I would drive it. Oh, so he wanted to test out the boat? No, he was driving for a second. This is his girlfriend. I was just sitting back for a second. Trying to monitor. And he told me to slow down, and then you guys hit the lights. And that was that. Okay. Um, so, so what he drove from the banana boat and then drove down to here. That that's the that's the distance uh, that he drove. Roughly, I don't. Know. Okay. All right. Um. <laughs> and so, and he asked you. I don't like. Or, or, or how, how did that? How did, I'm just trying to. Is your boat? So I'm just. Nobody around, so he just wanted to like drive a little bit. I was like, sure, no problem. So he asked you if you could drive. I didn't think there was a problem. You didn't think, oh, you felt comfortable that he was... I did. At the moment, I did, yeah. Yeah, okay. But you guys obviously don't think that, so... I don't... I don't yeah. Alright. Well, do you, do you disagree with us, then? Yeah. No opinion. Well, it is your opinion. Everybody has an opinion. I, I, I think I that he was just, I like, would, trying to try to I, I don't disagree. think that he realized how fast he was going, and I think that's where it kind of went wrong. Yeah. I, I don't think that he would do anything wrong. Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. Okay. I think that he was just trying to touch out the boat, and he was trying to be... Just having fun, and I think that he went overboard because he didn't know the limits of. Okay. Um. And what about you? Can, are you safe to to turn the boat over to? Do you feel completely safe? Do you feel safe to drive the boat? Yes, sir. Okay. So. All right. And you had you had all the safety. He had all the safety gear, right? You had a uh, tight for fire safety. Um. Hey, can you start up a, start up an India for a no fire extinguisher? So you're just gonna get a citation for your fire extinguisher because it's uh out of charge. It's, it's, yeah, it's not serviceable. And, um, so can you tell me what is, what is happening to him? Yeah, so he'll, Gun Club is um, the the main jail in okay. Palm Beach County, so that's where he's going to go, and, and then usually about eight hours, you can pick him up from the time you know, give or take a couple, depending on how long it takes to get booked, and then he'll is just it get a BUI or BUI. Or BUI. Just... Yeah, he'll get released with a court date. I'll take care of it. So. Yeah. So yeah. Um, Usually about about eight hours, give or take, is, is about. Uh, so it'll be a little late, late, a little bit later tonight, but he did, he'll uh, call you or whatever and come pick him up. Right. So you don't have to just go back to. Uh, I'll may take I ask a question? Yes, you can. May I get shoes? Yes. Do you have shoes over here? Uh, yeah, there's some. It's in the Do you have anything in your pockets or on you that you want to not take with you to the jail? Everything. I have a cell phone right here. 
Yes, sir. You don't want your cell phone? I, no, well, I, I mean, well, how's he going to call? Well, I don't, I've never. Well, I've it's going to get put in his pro. He can't have it with him in jail, but when he gets out, they're going to give it back to him. Right, so then I think I, I would recommend. It's up keeping to, it? I would recommend keeping it because when you can get out of jail. Me, can you do me a favor? Can you see what the battery is? Uh, double tap. Yeah, double tap the center. The center of the screen. 37. 37. I could turn it off for you. That I have. I, I mean, you can turn it off. You don't have to leave it on. Okay, so. Just, I'll have you, her turn it off. No, oh. it's. Oh. Okay, man. No, that guy, the far right one, was all. <laughs> we're, we're turning it off, correct? Yeah, turn it off. Sorry, baby. Stand out, fucking guy. Like all I do is fucking work. At it's fucking difficult. There it is. There. Power off. Top off. Power off. Power off. Okay. Yeah. So I would so recommend I keeping that, so that way you could call when okay. you get out of jail. So on my right side is gonna right, be my keys. Give them the hat and hat and sunglasses. It's gonna be my keys. And cigarettes. Am I able to like, No, you're not smoking on our boat. <laughs> okay. All right. Um, what is and this, on a my back, uh, That's a lighter. And on my back, there's probably $32. You May I say that? Yeah. Uh, no, we'll, we'll back left or back right, it's probably like $32. All right. There's the less you take with you, the better. Yeah. That's why I don't know what the right. what's the reason for the cell phone. I've never done this before. Well, so, so that way when you get out, you could call them because they're going to release you in a, in a few hours with the court date. Okay. So you're going to need to ride. Okay. Yeah. What am I I'm for boating on boating? Yeah, sit back down. Is boating it? under the influence. Okay. So it's basically like yeah. driving under the influence, but it's boating under the influence. So. So what does that do to me? Like my... it's a misdemeanor. Okay, so it's it doesn't affect your driver. It's your it's driver. A little, it's a little guy. It's it doesn't. It's still a big guy. It doesn't affect your driver's license. It doesn't give you any points on your license because it's on a boat. Okay. So it's just a misdemeanor. Fuck. So there will just be most likely fines associated with it, stuff like that. Okay, so how? Just for my knowledge, mm -hmm. how how do I? go about this like how do I contact people thank you yeah. how do I go about people like anything like that like how do I like right now or, or you mean no, later like, later on so, like oh you could whatever you mean like oh like for a defense and everything like that no no no, no. Oh, well, I'm, when I'm I just when you get out I'm going to jail so right. oh when you get out of jail just use your cell phone and call whoever you need yeah, they'll, they'll release you right out the door and then you're no bail no bond no nothing like that yeah I like, think the bond's a hundred bucks Well, whenever they, yeah, once once he gets to gets there and gets processed, then they'll give him the bond and a court date. 